Hey, what's up, guys? So, in the news is another celebrity death. Uh, this time it's John Lafia, the guy who wrote or co wrote the screenplay to Child's Play, Chucky, the murderous doll, the red headed doll. This guy, the red headed doll. <clears throat> All right. So, I'm reading some articles and it's saying that he died by suicide. So, I'm looking at some of this uh, information here on uh, Google, Wikipedia. He was uh, born April 2nd, 1957, and died April 29th, 2020. So I'm going to take this information from these articles and basically looking at dates on the calendar and, uh, you know, known as numerology and measuring from, you know, dates on the calendar to like, you know, movies being released and whatnot. You get certain numbers, and then you, the other half of this is the uh, a thing called gamatria. So it's like coding letters and numbers and, you know, words into phrases and numbers into words, pretty much. So uh, his name is John, right? John. Jan. <laughs> okay, let's see. What do I got here? Mm -mm 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 -mm. That's his birthday to his date of death. Okay. From his date of death to when I'm seeing the news. Or it might have actually even broke on the first. Or it could have. Uh, I got to look at some of these articles. Hold on. Four hours ago. One day ago. So I guess yesterday. May 2nd, right? That would be one day ago. May 2nd. Here's the 47. So that's why it's in the news. May 2nd, 47. Because look. In Gamatria. John, just using A is 1, B is 2. Very simple. Equals 47. J is the 10th letter. O is the 15th letter. H, 8. N is 14. You add them together, you get 47. All right. We got 20, 61, and 16. Now, I'm going to show you guys why this is all important. These are just the four base ciphers. A is 1, B is 2. Same thing here with the rules of numerology. Numerology is reducing a double-digit number to single digits. And, you know... J is the 10th letter, 1 plus 0 is 1. K is the 11th letter, 1 plus 1 is 2, as you can see. S is the 19th letter, 1 plus 9 is 10. 1 plus, one, 1 plus 0 is 1. And then you got the reverse, which is the alphabetic order flip-flopped. Z being 1, A is 26, and then same thing in rules of numerology. So 61 is the 18th prime. 18, 16. So let's see, John... Let's just type in his last name. Lafia? There's no middle name for him. 29, 20, 106, and 34. So just in the uh, four base ciphers, in full reduction, the rules of numerology. John, 20. Lafia, 20. 34. He's dead on the 29th, reportedly. April 29th. Lafia's 29. 34. 34, like murder. Now, I don't really know if this is exactly what's going on, but it makes you wonder... You know, death is 20, right? Like his last name, you know, R.I.P. 20 and 25, 38, like murder. You know, uh, let's see, let me just scan over this real quick and see. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Huh, 17, 19, hmm, 73 is a sacrifice number. I believe, sacrifice, yep, 73, 46, all right, so all these numbers are going to pop up, you'll see, all right, hmm, there is all the ciphers I have open, this right here is just the four base ciphers, but when I added certain ciphers that I thought were important, you know, the guy played in Chucky, Chucky equals 66 in Jewish ordinal, you know, just like, uh, you know, June 21st, 2019 was the new Chucky movie that released. So right here, Child's Play. It says right here, June 21st, 2019. And what's interesting about that is measuring from June 21st, 2019 to his reported suicide is 10 months, 8 days. So you don't have to count zero. So, you know, 10 months, 8 days kind of looks like 18, right? And again, you know, 
61 is the 18th prime. John is 61. So 61 is the 18th prime. So that's kind of interesting to see that pop up. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Hmm. There's a lot of interesting stuff when you open up this other cipher here. 71 is the 20th prime number. You know, his first and last name, 20. 26 will come into play because I've seen, I think I've seen 101. I'll have to look again, though. Let's see. Let's see, 281. I've seen a lot of 13s. 91's the 13 triangular number. And then we got some 89s. Well, maybe it didn't log in down here. But it will. Once I retype everything in. Huh? Unbelievable. Chaldeans 30. I mean, uh, 20. 67. The 19th prime number. And, you know, the guy's dead on a 19 date numerology. So, there's that part. <laughs> Unreal. Unbelievable. 670 looks like 67. Hmm. I know the 28 is going to come into play. 109 is the... No, 107 is the 28th prime. Where did I see 107? 107. It's not down here yet. It erased on me, so we're going to have to type all this stuff in again. But it's not really necessary to use all those ciphers right here. But, you know, it's interesting just to see what you can dig up. And again, I use this stuff to look for prime numbers, so, you know. That's that. Uh, let's see. Chucky. What is it? Child's. Child's play. There it is. 109 is the 29th prime number, right? 109. 29. Let's see. Lafia, his last name, 29. <laughs> Unreal. Unbelievable. So that's the 29. 109 is the 29th prime. 46. We've seen 46. Sacrifice is 46. Hmm. Hmm. 53 is the 16th prime. We've seen 16. All right. Did we see 60? Yep. John in reverse full reduction 16. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. All right, so April 29th, the day he reportedly died, right, has a 55-date numerology. 4 plus 2 plus 9 plus 20 plus 20 gives you 55. All right. 55, huh? Well, in single reduction, if you get 55. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Would you believe it? Do you believe it? 97 is the 25th prime. 153 is the 17th triangular number. And, you know, April 29th, 2020. 4 plus 2 plus 9 plus 2 plus 0, 17. Also, you know, just using the four base ciphers, you can, you know, kill is 17. You got the 28 right there. So, 44, 17, 64. 64, huh? 64 is a reflection of 46. Hmm. It's 8 o'clock. Mm-hmm. Mm hmm There's the 44 in Kabbalah. So his name, John in Kabbalah, L-C-H, Kabbalah cipher. You know, 44, kills 44. I'm not sure if these ciphers are actually just, um, you know, experimental. Some people say they are, but I think they all have their own weight that they pull. You know, so it's just, it's very strange to see everything sinking up this way. And, you know, again, like, they reported that he died of suicide, right? Suicide? So look at what suicide equals. Would you believe it? I think it's 46, right? No, it's 47. Okay, 47 and 34. You know, look at the day he passed away. Day calculator. 
Oh, actually, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know what? I'm reading the news today. Well, actually, it was said yesterday. I'm reading it the third. But look at yesterday's date in morality, 47. You know, it's just crazy, 27. Huh. Burnt. This is the 28 again. I'm reading it today. I'm reading it today. Let's see what else we can dig up here. 34 leg murder. Hmm. 37 was when Chucky came out. The newer one. Last year, June 21st, 2019. 37 date numerology. The day he passed away. 4 plus 29 plus 2 plus 0 plus 2 plus 0. 37. So, you know, it's like... some Something's definitely going on. Like, I don't know if it's people in a room matching it. Uh, or, or what. Or if it's some sort of AI. And then, you know, I don't know if it's just some sort of, like, lottery. Like... Oh, your number is up type of thing, but it just doesn't make much sense to me other than, other than, you know, this is like what I said, you know, people believe this stuff. They This is their religion or whatever is going on. And uh, they strongly, firmly believe that, you know, God merged the letter with the word, the number with the letter with the word. So, and it could be true, but I don't think God's cherry picking people like this. That's just, you know, to me, that's ridiculous. He was born on the 273rd day of the year. Is there anything to that? 273? Could be a prime number. It's not. All right. Hmm. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. So much to this. <laughs> so much to this. John equals 59. 905 can look like 59. A reflection. Let's see. 71. 171 is the 18th triangular number. You know? His birthday numerology when he was born in 57 has 18 day numerology. 4 plus 2 plus 5 plus 7, 18. The day he passed away, reportedly, you know, it says, you know, he has a 19-day numerology. But like I often say in my videos, I think they're killing these people a day in advance. And if that's the case, look, you got the 18-day numerology for the 28th. You got the 16. Did we see 119? Hold on. I don't think we see 119. We well, might have. We might have seen 119. Maybe not. It's not over here. Oh, yeah, look. Suicide, 119. Okay, so suicide in reverse ordinal, which is the alphabet backwards, like this chart. You can see the chart. 119. <laughs> Unbelievable. So that's what I'm saying. Like, okay, so, like, if they killed this guy, to, like, you know, on the 28th, it would make sense. Because April 28th is the 119th day of the year. And again, suicide equals 46. You know, it's just like, I don't know. It's tough to really put your finger on this stuff, but again, you know, 32, huh? 32 date numerology. That's interesting because, you know, 29, right? You know, I'm reading the story on the third. So, well, you know, 29 plus 3 is 32. So... He dies on a 32 date numerology. Oh no, is it 32? Hold on. What am I talking about? What was I talking about? Damn, burn. <laughs> well, something, something. I was trying to make some point. I just forgot. I just forgot. Oh yeah, there it is. April 28th is a 32 date numerology. So, I mean, you know, that might be a little bit of a reach or coincidence, but let's see. Let's look at some more of the stuff. So, I explained enough with the date and stuff. Uh, so much to go through, oh, man. Oh, man. June. 
So yeah, we covered that. All right, so let's type in some of this stuff, right? Click out of that, click out of that. John. Let's see, John Lafayette. Hmm. 167, the 39th prime number. I don't think there's any 39s. No 39s. All right, that's all right. That's all right. That is okay. All right, let's see. Yes, 63. Hmm. 59 is the 17 prime. We went through that. The whole 17, 49. Is there any 49s here? I mean, this date in numerology. He said he died on the 29th. Nothing there. Today's May 3rd. I mean, I'm sure it'll be in the news tomorrow. That's a 49 date numerology. With the 29, the 13. So I'm sure we'll see, you know, in the news, obviously, it'll be a concurring story all week because, you know. All right, let's see. Let's spell it out. 63, right? Hmm. 153 is the 17 triangular number. We could even look at it through here on the other the thing that has all the different ciphers here. Just see. Oops. A little bit of 1817, huh? Hmm. 17, 503, the 96th prime, 53, hmm, 16th prime, 184, one, I think 197 is the 45th prime, right? Yep, we've seen 54 and 45, right? 54, 63, you know? 54, 54, huh? Hmm. Crazy. Oh, well, man. One thirteen. There's the thirty-seven in reverse primes. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. If they did kill him on the twenty-eighth, they said the twenty-ninth. But if he, if they did kill him on the twenty-eighth, you got the seventy-two. Now here's the seventy-two right here. There we just see it. Seven o two looks like seventy-two. I mean, again, you got to take everything with a grain of salt. You know, I don't know if this is exactly what's happening, but they're definitely murdering people by this code, for sure. <laughs> Wake up. Wake up. Ding, fries are done. <laughs> Burn. 197. 179 is the 41st prime. 41 is the 13th prime. 91 is the 13th triangular number. Look at this, 131 is the 32nd prime number. Again, you know, if they killed this guy the day before they're reporting it, 32. 28 plus 4, 32. All right. Okay. Let's see, run through these numbers, run through these numbers. Five, is this a prime? It's not a prime. Let's see, is this a prime? Nope. 37, 113. Hmm. Again, you know, 1013 is the 170th prime. Where did we see 17? You know, 
you don't have to count zeros in numerology, so that looks like 17. And then 113 is also the 30th prime. So I don't know if there's any 30s. We can check quick. Let's see, uh, 29, date numerology. Yeah, I don't see nothing with that. But they waited to report it till today. So it's like, you know. Today has a 30 date numerology. 5 times 3 times 2, 30. I mean, you got to ask yourself, why are they waiting to report it? Like, you know, is it because the numbers match or exactly what's happening? 1,909. Well, again, 199, right? You don't count zeros. You got the 46. We've seen 46 already. We've seen 46. 63 years old. Hmm. 108 looks like 18. 91 is the 13 triangular number. Let's just run through a couple of these numbers and just see. 297. Is that anything? It's not. Okay. 297, 272. Hmm. 61 we seen with the 18th prime. 24, 27. Nope, not a prime. Let's take away the S here. Well, actually, you know what? Hmm. Yep, 89 is the 11th and 24th Fibonacci. Um, uh, 11th Fibonacci, 24th prime. I mean, again, yesterday they reported it, May 2nd, 11, 11 date numerology. Man. 207, 217. Hmm. The 260th prime. 260, huh? 260, 26. It might have even been in the news the first. I don't know, though. But I'm pretty sure that they had it in the news. I'm just seeing it today, kind of, though. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. What else is what's important here? Huh. 332, 233. So 332 is a reflection of you know, 233. Again, with the 13 and the 51, you add those two numbers together, you get 64. 64, 46, where did we see 64? And 46, we've seen 46 over here. And then I believe, if I'm not mistaken, there's the 46. I believe there might be a 64 down here somewhere. Could be in one of these other ciphers over here. Nope. Hmm. No, I don't seem to see it, but you know what? That's all right. Kill equals sixty four. <laughs> 4241, the 581st prime number. Hmm. It's an interesting number. 743, the 132nd prime number. 231, 21st prime number. That's interesting. When you type in 231, which is a reflection of 132, you get the 21st triangular number. You know, 73 is the 21st prime number. You know, and they're saying, and then look at April 29th, they reported it, 73 date numerology, 4 plus 29 plus 2, well, 20 plus 20 gives you 73. So it's just like, I don't know, to me, it's, it's kind of hard to say this is all a coincidence. And I mean, you got the 97 in keypad, 97 is the 25th prime, death equals 25. Hmm. 
72. Again, they could have killed him, you know, the day before. 72. It's like, why are these numbers just popping up? How come it's not like, you know, some strange number? Like, you know, why is the numbers either always on point or like a number on or off the day before or after? So, to think this is all coincidental, man. I mean, I mean, I'm stoned and I don't think it's coincidental. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna be a real kind of special retarded to think this is all just uh, matching up. There's the 233 again, though. So, um, 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 um. Let me see. Let me see. So we talked about his date. Oh yeah, getting back to spelling out his uh, age and all this. 63. Spelling it over here, 63 year old. Did I put 63 years old? Sometimes taking away like a word, I mean a letter, it yields a different like set of numbers. There's the 89, the 46, the 44, 38, like murder. Okay. 118, like death, in the Jewish cipher. 118. Just click the circle. Alright. D -E death. D E A T H death. 118. There you go. So there's that. 63 year old when you spell it out with the uh, numbers in letters. Hmm. Unreal. 104. Hmm. 14. Hmm. 9. 63, nothing there. 271. Hmm, the 58th prime number? I believe we've seen 58 somewhere. 85. I think we've seen 58. I could be mistaken, though. There's so many numbers that run across the screen. So, it was 59, not 58. Uh, I thought i seen 58. Yeah, there's 58 right there in Chaldean, which is like the cipher where, like, you know, back in the day, like, where, you know, like England, like 1500s, they use Chaldean, Septenary, you know, those are like, you know, those type of uh, things. 63 years old, 63 year old in Chaldean has that value of 58. So there's that. And again, you wouldn't know this if you didn't have these other ciphers open. So, I mean, you don't need these ciphers open to see, you know, you can use these four base ciphers and you can see a lot just with those. You don't really need all these other things open. I decide to keep them open because, you know, I think it's important. 729 is the square, it has a square root of 27, right? 27? 27, huh? Let's see. Let's see. I mean, I'm not reading the news until today. And it said, it reported it yesterday. The second, look, 27 date numerology. 5 plus 2 plus 20, 27. That's the thing. Like It, it has to be like an astronomical, you know, like thinner than human hair, like, pro, like odds, probability to like, for all this to match up, there's no way. That's basically the point, so... And look at this, 1369 is has a square root of 37. Where did we see 37? Where did we see it? Where did we see it? <laughs> Burn. I think his, his date of death has the 37. Hold on. It does. April 29th, 4 plus 29 plus 2 plus 0 plus 2 plus 0. 37. All right. So, I mean... I don't, I don't know, man. Crazy, dude. 271 is the 58th prime. We just said that. I think I went over that. Da, 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 da. 63 year old. All right, spelled it out with words and letters. I don't know if I put an S on the end of this. 
I may have. I may have. 16, we seen. See, when you spell out 63 years old, you get 101 in Jewish ordinal. Now, there's where all of our 26s come into play. 26. You know? 101's the 26th prime. There's a mathematical relationship between 101 and 26. So, you know? May 1st have the 26. Again, I'm reading it today. So they probably, you know, they reported that he died, you know, on uh, Wednesday, the 29th. And, uh, you know, they might have put it in the news, you know, on Thursday, the 30th, or Friday, the 1st. Which would make a lot of sense, Friday the 1st. You know, 5 plus 1 is 6 plus 20, 26. So that makes sense. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see, let's see. Oh, wow. Look at this shit. 659 is the 120th prime. Now, if I'm not mistaken, if I'm not mistaken, yep, April 29th, 2020, because it's a leap year, is the 120th day of the year. See how they do it? You see how they match it? Unreal, man. He died at 63 years old in English Sumerian, which is the cipher where you multiply everything by six. So A is six, B is 12, you know, all the way up to Z, 156. 603, see, he's dead at 63. Unreal. Unbelievable. Huh. Wow. It's also 900, 919, which is the 157th prime number, and 157 is the 37th prime number. Dead on a 37 date numerology? All right. It's like, I mean, at this point, you know, if the, all this is coincidental, then, you know, I don't think it is. It's just, it's really burnt, though, that people think it is. So, huh, 40th prime number. Hmm. That's interesting. 401, nice. The 79th prime number, and 79th is the 22nd prime number. There might be more to that. I don't know. Okay, let's see. What's going on? 1171 is the 193rd prime. Ha, huh, look at that. 193 is the 44th prime number. We've seen plenty of 44s. Kill 44. Uh, 63 year old, 44 in full reduction. I don't know. Can't make it up, but they do. <laughs> 35 in Chaldean. I think he died on a date numerology with. Uh, 35, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. Yep. 35, 4 plus 29, plus 2 plus 0. 35. Man. All right, so that's that. We covered that. Um, the other thing I want to check is the original release date. November 9th, 1988, 119. Hmm. Did we see 119? I think I checked and I didn't see it, but I could have sworn I seen a 119 somewhere. Huh. There's 118. Where's the 119? Am I thinking of another story that I seen? I might be thinking of another story, but that's the other point too. Like these numbers that I'm seeing in this story. They'll show up in another story that I do, and it's like, it's just so burnt, dude. It is. It really is. All right, so uh, this was his birthday. We covered most of these numbers in here. So I'm just making sure that uh, before I click out of this. Seven fifty-seven. That might be something to it. Seven. It is. It's the hundred and thirty-fourth prime. One thirty-four, huh? Hmm. Well, and then the reflection of one thirty-four is four thirty-one, which is the eighty-third prime. Eighty-three, like murder. Hmm. Unreal. Eighty-three is the twenty-third prime number. I think we've seen some twenty-threes down here too. Let's see, let's see. I mean, 23s, come on. There it is. John, in Jewish reduction, 23. 
Uh, what else? There's probably some other stuff in here right here. 23 and September. I don't really use these ciphers often, but, uh, you know, just to kind of like prove a point. Chucky. <laughs> Seven, uh, Chucky equals 23 and this, uh, Septeri, Septeri, or however you pronounce it. Septenary. Septenary cipher. Okay, that's that part. All right. But also, I was looking for 134, so I don't know. Is there anything down here? Hold on. 134. Look at this. Chucky. Hmm. Can't make it up, man. In English extended. So what English extended is, is basically, you know, our alphabet, but with the rules of, like, Latin. So, like, you know, G it's still A, B, C, 1, 2, 3, but J is the 10th letter, K is 20, L is 30, and it goes up by 10s. Where it changes is R is 90, S is 100, T is 200. You, you know, you see? Now, with that being said, Chucky in that cipher equals 1,034. Looks a lot like, you know, 134, right? All right. So that's the that's one point I wanted to make with that. Now, this uh, original movie came out when? Let's see. Uh, November 9th, 1988. November 9th. Let's see. Uh, he was born 4 2 57. Let's measure from the movie's release date to his birthday. From his birthday to the movie release. So let's see. 19. Oops, 88, right? Huh. 31 years and 77 days. Hmm. Well, look at this. The movie, the original movie released at. Look at this date numerology. Okay, hold on. This, there's a lot here. Hold on. <laughs> this is burnt, dude. 127. Okay, so 127 is the 31st prime, and 31 is the 11th prime. So with that in mind, you know, we've already talked about, you know, 11, and there's just so much to this. Yesterday when they reported at 11, 11 date numerology, there's that. Now let's go through this a little bit. Let's go through this just a tad bit. We've seen the 46, the 37, we've seen 108, we've seen 27. I know for a fact we've seen 20, 118. I think we've seen 99, to be honest. Let's see. I'm pretty sure we've seen 99. I'm pretty sure. But I could be wrong. Nope, I'm not wrong. When you spell it out with words, 63 years old in reverse full reduction, which is the four base ciphers. So you don't even need all these other ciphers open. But just to make a point, right? Here you go. There's your 99. Unbelievable, man. Unbelievable. So there's that. And then, you know, I'm pretty sure we've seen 52. I'm not going to go crazy trying to look for it all, but, you know, 52 is a reflection of 25. It goes on and on and on, man. 25 death. There might be a 52 down here, though. I just want to look. I want to make sure. I'm pretty sure we do have a 52 somewhere in here. It's probably in one of these other ciphers. This, this, uh, these weird ciphers down here. Alright, so it's 51. It's not 52. Hmm. Okay, maybe I was thinking of something different. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. It's not there. But either way, you got reflection numbers and you got all this stuff. So, uh, the next thing I want to look at is 77. Seven months, seven days. So I I don't know. Did I see seventy seven? Could have sworn I seen seventy seven. Sixty six. There's seventy seven. I knew it. 
63 year old when you don't use the s the years old 63 year old now again you know these ciphers a lot of people don't use a l w kabbalah but look 77 it equals what it equals in that cipher it's just like what are the odds why not it be like you know whatever you know it could have been 70 you know five or something i don't think i've seen any 75s today so huh, 72 so he's dead on a date numerology with uh 73 and like i was saying you know 28 the 28th had the 72 uh, the 72 72 down there in that lch kabbalah cipher child's play is 72 hmm a lot going on here child's play co-screenwriter let's see maybe if we just use the language that they're using you know maybe something will pop up because i haven't really even looked at that you know i just been basically rambling and ranting about you know what i've noticed but look let's see we've seen 23 right 230 looks like 23 409 is the 80th prime i think we may have seen 49 somewhere oh, i just clicked out of the thing Ooh, spaghetti. that's all right there was too much on the screen anyways Forty nine, huh? Man. Huh. Huh. Okay, um so measuring from his date of death to his upcoming birthday, which would be next year would be 11 months and four days i mean i guess if you include the end date it would be 11 months five days and you know that's important because you know a lot of this stuff is uh masonic in nature man so masonic 115 <laughs> 29 yeah they got them <laughs> the 29 date numerology 74 is a reflection of 47. Also, 29 is the 10th prime, right? Yep. Look at the day he's dead. Oops, hold on. Hold on. I'm seeing the story today, May 3rd. 5 plus 3 plus 2 plus 0 is 10. They put it out in the news yesterday, May 2nd, or even May 1st. They may have put it out. May 1st has the 10 date numerology. Unreal. Unbelievable. Huh. I don't know. But, uh, let's see. There's anything that stands out here? 379, 221. Hmm. Two twenty one. Hmm, one twenty two. I mean I don't know if they they may have reported it on the first. I don't I'm not sure. Uh 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 two twenty three, the forty eighth prime. I may have seen some eighty fours or forty eights, I don't know. I clicked out of that other one, so I don't know. I can't go back and look. Today has a 48 date numerology though. May 3rd, 5 plus 3 plus 20 plus 20. <laughs> 48. And didn't we see a 60 prime number? Um, now I'm seeing it. Okay, 60. 5 times 3 times 2 times 2, 60. <laughs> Unreal. We might have even seen 144, but I clicked out of that other freaking thing that logged all my stuff in. Pretty sure I've seen 144 in all those other ciphers. There was something in there. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. 
Let's see. Forty first prime, forty one's the thirteenth prime. We've seen plenty of those. Six thirty one. Look at that. And I'm talking about you know, one hundred and fifteen, measuring from. Unbelievable, dude. Unbelievable. Well, I don't know what I was measuring from, but I'm pretty sure that it was one hundred and fifteen. I was making that point, and uh, or was it a date numerology? I think it was a date numerology or something. It's one fifteen or something. Well, anyways, anyways, six thirty one is the hundred and fifteenth prime number. <laughs> And that's just using the language that these people are using. It's not like, I think I may have changed up dead. Instead of saying dies at 63, I think I put dead at 63. But still, I mean, like, what are the odds? Like, it's just, I don't know. Unreal. Uh, we've seen 153, the 17th triangular number. 18, death. Hmm. Oh, 61 is the 18th prime. That's what I meant to say. Child's Play Screenwriter. Let's see when we take that away. Huh, oh, there's the 113 again. 13. Okay. Huh. Screenwriter has the 157. 157 is the 37th prime, right? Dead on a 37 date numerology. 67 is the 19th prime. 19 is the 8th prime. Hmm. 19 is the 8th prime, huh? Well, tell me why May 1st has an 8 date numerology. So if they did report it on the 1st, and I'm seeing it, you know, today, two days later, I, you know, again, look at that. Screen rate is 77. <laughs> we were talking about 77. That's another one for the list. 167 is the 39th prime. We've seen the third. We've seen the 37, the 39, the 77. Burnt, dude. All right, so that's just that's just crazy, dude. Maybe if we put American screenwriter, screenwriter might sit, might equal something. There's the 122 again, right? Just like uh. You know, if I'm, you know, saying I, he could have been killed the 28th, he could have, you know, and they reported it the first, the first 122. Again, you know, there's no real way to really know. 43 is the 14th prime. Oh, boy. Okay. I think that's what he go. Uh, what does it say right here? Andy Barclay. That's the the kid in the movie. Let's see if there's any connection with his that the character. Of course. 16. 53 is the 16th prime. 43 is the 14th prime. 191, the 43rd prime, which is the 14th prime. That's what I meant to say. 43 is the 14th prime. Yeah, well, there's, yeah, 43. One, nine, 191 is the 43rd prime, so there's a connection there. With that character, I guess. Uh, let's see, what else can we pick from this? 1988 horror movie. Let's see, maybe this has some value to it. Horror movie. Horror movie. Let's see. Hmm. 60. I think we've seen 60 somewhere. 57, 75. Hmm. 
149 is the 35th prime when you put an S on the end. Horror movies, 35. Dead on a 35 date in numerology. 68. Huh. 68, huh? May 1st, 6 and 8. Unreal. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Oh boy. We're devastated to hear our friend. It's strange because, like, the quotations that they use, they equal shit. It's like, it's just burnt, dude, how they do it. 25, 250 looks like 25. 839 is the 146th prime. 8, 146. I don't know if that's significant. Because I clicked out of it. Damn. 116th prime, 641, the reflection. Could be something there. There's the 60 again. 281 is the 60th prime. So. Today has a 60 date numerology. Multiplication. So it's just like, you know. And it goes on and on and on, man. It goes on and on and on. One article said, they were quote unquote devastated. Now look at this. Devastated is 101, which is the 26th prime, right? Okay. 29 is the 10th prime. His last name, 29. 169 has a square root of 13, right? We've seen a lot of 13. 61 is the 18th prime. So it just keeps going on and on and on, man. 1010 looks like 11. You know? Today. Well, yesterday when they reported it. It could have been reported the first, but the articles I'm seeing right here say yesterday. This one's May 3rd. This other one says yesterday, which would be May 2nd. So May 2nd has the 11. Man. Sick how they do it, man. Child's Play 2 Filmmaker. Let's see what Filmmaker equals. Hmm. Filmmaker. Of course. 43... Huh. We've seen 65 somewhere, right? Andy Barclay, 65. Filmmaker, 56. It's a reflection. 191's the 43rd prime. Oh, boy. See, you don't need all those extra ciphers open. But, you know, just to kind of hit the, you know, nail in, drive the nail in, sometimes I like to open up extra shit. But, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to wrap it up with that because you can go on and on and on and on and on. 197, there it is again, the 45th prime. We've seen 118. Death equals 118. Oh, Latin, Jewish cipher. Here it is. 289, square root of 17. Has a square root of 17. Can't make it up. Uh, dead on a 17 date, uh, date numerology. Just crazy. I, I wasn't even looking for this. 246. There might be a 246 somewhere, too. I wouldn't even be surprised if the uh, other thing I had open had a 246 or something in there. I would not be surprised the least bit. But, uh, I mean, there's probably so much more to this, but, you know... I'm pretty sure, uh, I'm pretty sure that, uh, you know, I did enough here to prove the point. Child's play two. Huh. What do you know? 48. We seen the 55. He's dead on the 55 date numerology, right? April 29th, four plus two plus nine plus 20 plus 20, 55, right? 617? Ha, huh, look at that. 617 is the 113th prime. Unbelievable. Burnt. And then I know 163 is what, the 38th prime, right? 38. There it is. Death. R.I.P. Ooh, man. And they use the language co-writer. That might mean something too. That might mean, there it is again. Co-writer is 111, 48, 
105-51. Huh. So, yeah, Child's Play 2 is 111 in 48. Co-writer, 111 in 48. So it's like, what are the odds of that, right? All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wrap it up there because, you know what, I can go on and on and on. And there'll always be other stuff to, like, you know, see. So, you know, look, 2019, you know, 67. What is it, the 19th Prime or something like that? I think it's 67. Is it 67? Let me just make sure. It is, all right. Okay. Look at this. <laughs> Would you believe it? 77% like this movie. <laughs> 77, again. IMDB rates it at 5.8. And look at this. Rotten Tomatoes, 63%. He's dead at age 63. Look at this. 48, we've been talking about. At Metacritic, 48%. But do you see? And again, look. Two hours long, the movie, the new movie. Now, I don't know. Obviously, I'm not sure if he had a part to play in this, but with 60 plus 60, it's 120, right? Now, look. Burn, dude. Dead on a date numerology. Well, look, day of the year, April 29th, because it's a leap year. The 120th day. I'm done. All right. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. And, uh, you know, looks like another murder by numbers. 45 million. Unbelievable. Box office. And this is the new movie. This isn't even the old movie. Like, the old movie... I don't know, man. The old movie, I don't know what it had as a box office. Let's say right here, maybe. Huh. 87 minutes, huh? Huh. Well, I'm sure there's a lot more to it. Probably even like this. The guy who directed it, Tom Holland. They probably synced it up. But I'm going to leave it there because you could just keep matching stuff all day long. I know i seen 114. i seen 48. i seen the 156. Look, horror movie 156. Tom Holland 156. I mean, it goes on and on and on. But, uh, yeah, thanks, guys, for watching. And uh, I'll see you on the next one. I will see you on the other side.